You have so upset Maisie. What did he say to her? Nothing. Nothing. Some pie. Well, it sound like nothing to me. What? She's oversensitive. It's not my fault she can't take a joke, is it? Ryan, just tell me what you said. All right, she was walking back from Jay's and I might have a little bit maybe made a joke about him not letting her spend the night there. And <sighs> she might have gone off on one for some reason. Ryan. I know. Sorry. <sighs> Do you want anything else from town? Uh, no, just the parts and those spark plugs that won't belong. All right, see you in a bit. If the traffic's bad, don't come back. We'll do it in the morning. All right, see you. <sighs> You're so late. I'm sorry, babe. It's, uh, traffic was really bad, actually. I'd better phone her. But Debbie. You can do that in the morning, after you've apologised to Maisie. What, what for? Well, breathe in if you have to. Just make her feel better, OK? I will, when I've had my pint. I will, I promise. Oh, Hi, uh, a pint of lager and a, a vodka and orange, please. Sure. And um, whatever I said or did to upset you, I'm sorry. There's no need. N no, it's, Katie's been bending my ear. And I know I can be insensitive and a bit of an idiot, but I'm a bloke, so you can give me a bit of slack, yeah? I know. I behave like a brat. No, in fact, a brat would have behaved better than that. I took everything out on you, and I'm really sorry. No, it's my apology, not yours. No, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. No, I think we're all sorry, yeah? So we sorted then? All of us? Totally. Shake on it.